What is up y'all? Welcome to another video. If it's your first time stopping by my channel, I'm Jeff Rowe and this is Jeff Rowe's Fish Keeping. In today's video, I unbox some frogs. Yes, I said it, frogs. The only reptile I've ever kept in my entire life was years ago I kept an iguana. I didn't get any kind of a fancy terrarium or anything like that with him and I didn't really keep him all that long. I didn't do very good with him. But my good buddy over at Dank Tanks talked me in to getting a terrarium and setting it up with some frogs. And that's what I'm doing on today's video. Hopefully you guys enjoy. All right guys, as you could see in the thumbnail, I picked up a couple of White's tree frogs. Um, other names for them is the uh, the dumpy frog or the Australian tree frog. I'll also go ahead and put the scientific name up there in the description. But I brought them home in this. I had this styrofoam cooler with the lid and the guy that I bought them off of found this old um, terrarium lid and uh, went ahead and kept them in this overnight. And now that I've got the Exoterra set up, I'm gonna go ahead and get them out and uh, went ahead and gloved up because they're slimy and hard to hang on to. But I'll try to get you guys a good little picture here. And uh, we'll go from there. See if we can get a hold of these guys without them running off. That one right there is jumpy. He is jumpy. What now? So I think I'm going to get this one first. He's jumpy. We'll let him stay. We'll move him after this one. This one's the, the more calm one. They can change colors, and I've noticed since I've had them that they do. Right now, this little guy is really calm, and uh, we're going to go ahead and release him into his terrarium. So we'll be right back. Aren't they cool? Look at that little guy. All right, I'll be right back. All right, guys. Got Mr. Froggy here. You guys see him? Look at how cool he is. He won't focus. There he is. Isn't he cool? I'm going to go ahead and get him in his new place. And then, after I get him in there, skirting to the back out of camera range so I'm gonna go ahead and shut you guys off and I'll pick you back up in just a second all right guys here's the second one I got the first one in there already here's the second one the first one I don't know where he is went oh he climbed up on the back wall this little guy right here is a swarmer Golly. They are in the new terrarium. And uh, let me get you guys picked up here. Let me get you guys picked up here. And uh, there's one. We're going to call him Squirmy for right now. Good grief. And uh, the other one, if you guys can see may have to come over here let's see where did he go yeah there he is right to the left of the suction cup can't hardly see him through the moisture but he's right there on the back wall right behind the suction cup and then that other one's hanging out in the water dish Ooh, he just jumped boy they're cool he is so cool. I'm officially a frog keeper. 
Got that really nice piece of Mopani in there. I've got everything moist and humid and warm in there for them. Um, I hear that they're pretty messy. Um, that you pretty much got to scrape it with razor blades after so long because they make such a mess. But um, I know when I picked him up, he shot water everywhere. They take in water through their vent and they pretty much just set down in the water and suck out all the water and then they also release it in their water too so you gotta change their water quite often and frequent but yeah that pretty much concludes the unboxing of my white's tree frogs little dumpy frogs he just kinda spazzed out there just now <laughs> And uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed. I'll try to get some good footage of them. Um, and uh, we will go from there. So what would you guys think? The White's Dumpy Tree Frogs are so awesome. I got one of them that's squirmy, that always wants to get out. And I got one of them that's really chill. You can get him out any time of the day, any time of the night. And he's just chill. They're so personable. Every time you walk through the room, they're looking at you. They're watching you. They're following you. And it's just really cool. I love them a lot. They are um, a little bit messy, but they're easy to care for. To me, they're like the cherry shrimp of the uh, shrimp keeping hobby. You know, I mean, as long as you keep them damp and humid and warm and keep plenty of water and keep everything clean for them they'll do really good so if it is your first time stopping by my channel make sure and hit that subscribe button and while you're at it don't forget to hit that post notification bell so you don't miss out on any one of my videos right now I'm uploading videos every Monday and every Thursday and I also live stream every Wednesday and Saturday night thanks for coming along on this video hopefully you guys enjoyed We'll catch you on the next one. Peace out, y'all.